And we're back. Oh, we're Here playing we go. Pokemon. We're playing Pokemon 2006. It's going to go great, you know? Super a lot of knowledge of the decks. So bear with us, guys. Actually, we have none, so. First time we're seeing these decks today. Literally, yeah. I did not play it this time. But I do have the deck lists up. So we'll see what's going on here. It's going to be Meta Knight versus Blastoise. Should be a good time here. I'm going to see what this Metagross does. Remind them that it's family friendly. Oh, good call. Family friendly. Yeah, I knew that. Pokemon. The bigger problem is that Espeon can pick up the Ampros. Yeah, I didn't swear last week. And I'm shocked. Yeah, I got a comment. Okay, discard as many energy cards as you like attached to your Pokemon in play. I almost slipped out and I caught myself in my gout. Like, That's a dope effing draw. <laughs> right. yeah, uh, yeah. 14. Alright, so Dragonite excels energy. Lightning energy. Just so you know. Last place is Rain Dance. On Shocker. Yeah. You take damage, though. Oh, do you? Oh. You know, common Blastoise ability, uh. Rain Dance literally has it like every time it's printed for some reason. Yeah, the games in this format take much longer than current. Uh, You're not taking three prizes in turn. Yeah. You're pretty much taking like six individual prizes, which is what's After, cool. The two turns of setting up, I think, is like what the biggest difference is. Yeah, oh, definitely. And when we played, I feel like it was like the first like two turns are just so slow in comparison to like today's format. Look for friends, fast evolution. Like, yeah, those are yeah. your first attacks. Yeah, literally. All right, I didn't see what Nick started, uh, but let's see what Dwayne's got a basic for sure. What's he got there? I have no idea. All right, and are we going to get into it? Nick's choosing who goes first. Who knows? All right, Dwayne's starting off. All right, here we go. Got your teeny start. I like one thing. I wasn't. A, I didn't really do much with the cards at the time, but I, I appreciate the Delta species idea. Yeah, super cool. Super, super cool. Unique. Alright. Gonna see a transceiver. Probably get some basics on the board here. Uh, he's going to, he can't play it, but he can get it right next Yeah, yeah. You are correct. Ooh, and we're going to get paralyzed here. Nope, missed it. And, oh, does damage though, so we'll take that. I think we have a weakness. Yeah, for sure. Ooh, the squirts gets on the board. Seeing a transceiver here. Let's see what he gets. Probably he has uh, to get a mentor. Probably gonna get a mentor. Yeah, put some guys on the board and some more squirts. What other attackers does it play? Um, it has. Uh, let's see. What we've got. We've got Steelix, Latias, Gold Star. Okay. Um, I think some of these Pokemon, let's just let's do that. Lugia EX can 
take some setup, but with the rain dance, with the uh, all on attachments, you can meet their odd energy requirements. Right, right, right. Searching the deck, just looking for what he's got in there. Drachi Pidgey. I think that's one another thing I thought of when I was looking at this, uh, learning about this format in terms of speed of the game, is because it takes so much to set up, you can sit with the Drachi asleep and not have to move yeah, it. Yeah, for like, sure, for sure. Now we like a skateboarder switch has to happen. You can't just sit there. That Drachi gets you any card. That that too. Which is insane. Very similar to the one we play today, but for a trainer. Dang, Porygon comes out. Porygon, Pidgey, and Jirachi. I'd look up Porygon too quick. It's artillery, but better. Mm. Oh, yeah, for six, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look at that knowledge of the 2006 cards that we have. Wow. Nick honestly had a pretty good turn right there. You got yeah. a big setup. Come on. Didn't attach. Thought I would, we were going to see a corner, honestly, but he didn't have the energy. You get the basics in play. Beldum ability has free retreat. If, yeah, one. yeah. We had that one, didn't we, for a bit? I think so. I hope so. I hope we did. Could just be wrong. Gets the cast form, Beldum, and a Dratini. like that we're just gonna get a big thunder wave again paralyzed, paralyzed to the 20 right. more damage who knows who knows which way you turn it actually oh here we go candy stoice Nick trying to figure out which Pokemon to candy into. Go to the Pidgeot. Gets a Pidgeot. Turns out it's really good. So good. Free computer search. Get any card. Not two, though. You can't do two of them in a turn, which was news to us, but. You know, who knows what these cards do sometimes. I gave up on reading. You know? You see, you can get any card, and you're just like, oh, yeah, for sure. I'm just going to do this a bunch. Oh, I guess I can. Mm -hmm. See, scientist. Okay. Play scientist. Discarding. Okay, just a. It's got something. Few. Ooh, there's the Porygon, though. Yeah, Porygon. So sick. Between Porygon and Pidgeot, he should be pretty set up. Yeah, good to go for a few turns here. Let's use backup. Drop six. Yeah, it looks like Nick. You just can't draw any energy either at all, honestly. Uh, quick search. And 
That's too bad. Say, let's look at the count. I know it's not a small number for his deck. He plays the cast forms too. Yes, that as well. Man. Yeah, I'm looking sh shuffle through his deck and so it doesn't even look like. Yeah, yeah, he's just missing them. Two, three, four, five, six. There's at least six in the deck, minimum. Double pitch yet. Can't use the ability again, as stated before, but. Free retreat and got, yeah, free retreat's acceptable pretty good. attack? Yeah, definitely. No, no, no. You can only quick search one time. Hopefully, he doesn't uh, do it. There we go. We're doing some stuff now. Uh, we totally know what's going on. Pretty incredible combination of abilities uh, going into the yeah, Jirachi. To say the very least. Pretty nuts. Dwayne's going to have to really, like, have a good second turn here to compete with all the speed that Nick has on the board. You can get two Metagross out. You can really yeah. draw some cards. Yeah. And then the one Dragonite. If you can just get one Dragonite to start excelling. No, Nick. No. Oh, I can only use one. And Nick Foltz did go for the second Pidgeot ability, even not the though only he one. cannot. At least he joins group with uh, my co-commentator here. We Nicks are struggling. It's a struggle, man. <laughs> you know, nobody's perfect. Okay. You have a uh, hundred HP or more. Which Pretty good stadium. If it's under a hundred, but if it's full health, it would be a hundred. You still take damage. Little uh, shrine of punishment esque uh, stadium. Yeah, I thought those were. I thought those were interesting. Lots of good stadiums. I Lots see. of good stadiums in this format, definitely. I like to see it, honestly. And honestly, I, when I before coming into this pretty blind, I didn't know how good the draw supporters were, were going to be, but they ended up being pretty fine. I thought I was going to have like, a hard time drawing cards, but the decks have pretty good engines for sure. Nick finally seeing some energy in that hand, thank God. You like to see it. I'd like to see him get a Blastoise, though. But he definitely has Quick Search. Dwayne, it doesn't look like he even has a Matang in his hand. Thunder Waves. Thunder Waves Ooh. again. Oof, you don't like to see it. Would have loved oh, to see even get a Metang down would have been yeah. great. Because you're a sleuth. Oh, you can't be both? Yeah. Okay. Unlike our new Jirachi, this cannot be used. Yeah. I don't know how many Switch cards Nick Foltz's deck plays. Turn three or four here, first attachment from hand. Pretty nuts. Looks like he plays two switch and a swoop. Okay. So he can at least get that Jirachi up active, hopefully. He's an admin. He's gonna actually see a lot of cards here, including one that one that he just wants to have himself. And worst case scenario, if he doesn't move, he sets him up for an incredible position for next turn. Yeah, yeah. 
outside of If you're Nick, you're Dwayne. not bummed that you yes. saw Dwayne have absolutely, like, nothing yes. in response. You know you should be able to take another turn yeah. before any pretty kind of much pressure scot gets free. put on. Yeah. Just gets a war turtle. All right. With the quick search. Doesn't have candy, I assume. You can only assume that he doesn't have candy if he just got war turtle. I feel like paralyzed over is like worse than asleep, though. You know what I mean? It is, but uh, it can't be both, unfortunately. Um, That's crazy. I didn't realize that. Anyways. I don't think you can be any two turn conditions at the same time. Just, right, actually, I'm correct. I'm not familiar enough with the rule. Yeah, honestly, uh, couldn't tell you. Transceiver. We're going to see a transceiver. He's going to get something out of the deck, a Holland guy out of the deck, probably scientist just to draw cards. You'd hope. But there could be something that I don't know. Seeing what he um, wants with the transceiver. Yeah. Is that an adventurer? I don't recognize Yeah, he gets an adventurer. Draw three cards. If you discarded a Pokemon that has uh, okay. the Delta, or I believe it's Delta, you draw four more. And that's a good Or you draw four deck. instead. You draw four instead of three. Definitely. Doesn't look like he... Hits like candy or even Matang again. Like, not too bad. He has a quite sizable hand at this point. Yeah, very big hand. Uh, yeah, he's not stoked on that hand for sure. I wouldn't be surprised if we really just see like an attached uh, Beldum, maybe attached to Dutini and just pass or Thunder Wave. Yeah, attached to, to Dutini. Probably just gonna end up seeing another like, fourth thunder wave in a thunder row. Wave. Yep. Okay. Still, still uh, not paralyzed, which is good for Nick Foltz here. Yeah, there we go. We're gonna stadium. see the Blastoise here. We're going to attach the cast form Pick to... Pick up the water. Yep. With that stadium and the, and the rain dance ability, you will, we will see some damage getting out of that Lugia. Yeah, definitely. But if you're Nick Fultz, you can't be too upset. Like, Dwayne's had no, no start. Ooh. I don't know why he would add them. But who's to say? I definitely probably made some wrong plays. He wants to start being aggressive. Yeah, he it? wants to play offense, which I respect. Because uh, although Dwayne had a large hand, he still all of his Pokemon are basics at this point, and um, even in end of six, uh, he would need a lot to really get going. Yeah, yeah. I guess if you're if you're Nick, you're just thinking like I'm so far ahead. I need to just like press the there press the That's advantage good. I have. Put the stadium in play. Gonna Jirachi. Gonna get a water energy. Uh, what supporter is that? Uh, stadium. I'm gonna quick search in a moment. Power tree. This will 
allow Nick to start getting water energy out of the discard. Once yeah. We start getting I'm going to assume there. he's going to get a switch card right here. I don't know if he has one in his hand already, but... Oh, Dwayne actually at least has a Mete in his hand, though. So we won't just be seeing Daldums and Dratinis the whole time. And we will see the Lugia EX Elemental Blast for 200. Onto the Dratini. We do see both cast forms uh, have to be discarded. So that ends up being four, uh, four energy. Yeah. Pretty crazy. We will see a Metang come down. Pretty stoked for it. Yeah, we like to see some evolutions and a draw support. We like to see, yeah. We like to see Stadium. more than Thunder Wave. Not saying Thunder Wave isn't bad, but you don't want to just be sitting there. Yep, we're going to see Catcher. Uh, pretty much Catcher. Yes. Yep. He said, I'm over Poor Gun, too. <laughs> Very good ability. We're gonna free retreat. We we'll probably see a thunder wave, honestly. Unless we don't retreat. Unless we don't retreat, but I'm thinking he's gonna do it. No. Yeah, yeah he's just gonna pass. I don't recall the exact specifics of Dragonite's ability, but I know that could be tough um, if he didn't have um, anything in play. Yeah, the Dragonite is, uh, you may attach a Lightning energy card from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon. Attacking options suck. And, uh, um, some solid attacks to go with it as well. Alright, uh, I'm gonna Rain Dance twice. Let's see, double Rain Dance to Pidgeot. Gonna assume... Yeah. I'll probably just get another switch card here to get Porygon out of the active. A quick search. We will start to be a little limited. Yeah, um, definitely. See a transceiver come down. Oh, I can get it from my discard too, can I? Yes. Let me do that. <laughs> Sorry. And we're going to change it up and go to the discard. That's all you right. know? It's a pretty to... pretty bananas Supposed card. To... Yeah. Oh, I guess the rule was... No, I didn't play them. You, you can only search one or the other. No, I realize. Here, how about this? That, I'll use quick search. No, okay. Quick search. Okay. Yeah, that'll Instead that'll of the transceiver start. coming down, just, we'll change the plans. Know. We're going to quick search first. No, you're fine. So that's yeah. quick search. Yep. We're getting the switch. Then I'll hold on to receiver from my discard file. Got to switch up the sequencing. Easy fix. Easy fix. Seems fine. Yeah. And this is we certainly are three. dealing with all new cards, all new poker uh, powers, even the term poker power. I was using it as a, like a deck search initially, and then I was like, oh, wait, I can do this. Uh, I'll take a scientist again. Forty. Yep, we'll hit you with the Pidgeot attack. Forty. Again, Nick Nick Faults isn't in a bad situation yeah. at all here with that. I mean, not being able to retreat is nice. Pretty nice. Dragonite. But we do see Dragonite. Dwayne's finally gonna excel. Oh man, this you can look if at the top four of your cards and yep. put one in hand. You rearrange the rest at the bottom. So yeah, you very can good. Definitely get yourself out of a rut and seeing four cards every, uh, every turn. Dwayne, you're very happy that you finally have seen yes. some sort of hand. You feel like the game's getting going at this yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. And honestly, you don't take too much too much like damage from having like such a slow start. Like a very slow start. No 
electric energy in there. That is something we'd like to see. Pile hand extension of the Porygon again. Yeah, we're bringing the Porygon back up, boys. Here it is. I am down in prizes, so oh, I can move okay. an energy or catcher effect. I yeah, yeah. Said, it's pretty much custom. That effect. card's pretty much oh, cust oh, or, uh, counter catcher. Uh, it has uh, two different effects uh, it can yeah. have, I believe. What is the other one? Oh, it's a move and energy from the active no. the bench. Um, so yeah. it's a, kind of a unique card, but yeah. if you're down nice. on prizes, it's nice. Yeah, you gotta keep yeah, the, we're gonna see the desert, yeah, desert ruin ruins going. Nick just mentioned that he's gonna get a stadium because he sees the damage that that's happening. I mean, you have these Pokemon that are worth two prizes with 100 HP. Yeah, I um, think Blastoise is like 150. Yes. Yeah. And that's as high as it gets. So. Was Blastoise Lightning Week? Yes. Ooh, we don't like to hear that, but I mean, uh, I mean the. Metagross is metal. It'll be alright. It is actually a metal and lightning. Oh, it, oh, it's dual type. If I recall correctly. It is. You are correct. So, so is Dragonite. Dual type. Definitely not something that you're going to see in today's game. Well, I mean, you've seen it with Volcanian EX. With Volcanian. That was your boy. Great card. Great card. Bring him back. Looks like Nick's going right. to... Giant Stump. Like We're going to see... A He's probably going to get rid of that. you got to assume the Lugia. I mean, you don't want to give up that, those prizes, I feel like. I get to see the Jirachi. Oh. One Pidgeot. Oh, it gets rid of the Porygon. I feel like I would have kept it, but I would have gotten rid of one Pidgeot, I feel like. Um, I think his, his concern with that, uh, both are great cards, um, is that if this one likely gets knocked out this turn, potentially, then he'd be left with no Pidgeot. Yeah. But you do just see Nick take the knockout on the Beldum. They have a thunder wave. It's because of lightning. He's been he's been attacking with dragon dratini for like oh, the first okay. part of the game. Ah, okay. Yeah. There was a point where there was like forty damage. Did you just do like two hundred of dratini? Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I saw some of the damage. I was like, <laughs> yeah, I did have two hundred. Right. We're gonna see an admin We're come down. We're gonna see an admin. And you guys, if you guys got any free time, just make sure you know you follow the stream. You know, Top Cut Network. They're doing these retro tournaments. They're sick. Topcutevents.com. Top cut <laughs> Please follow. That's all we're asking for. Every time I hear this song, I think of that commercial. That's, that's playing out of the sky. It's like, I got a rat problem. <laughs> and yeah. Here we go. Right, we're seeing a new hand. Very that very is... Uh, that gives you a retreat. Ah, Spatial yep. Electric energy for turn. Fluffy Berry. We're oh, seeing desert. it. And then Desert Ruins. And back to the Ruins. Ooh, and we're ruined. And then I'm going to use Delta Control. Okay, and we're looking at some cards. Now, yeah. if you're Dwayne, you're super happy. You're you going to start seeing some stuff going on here. You make sure you can at least get something to get you going each turn. He plays, uh, I believe he plays four of those uh, reversals, the Pokemon Catcher. This could be key. Those are huge, especially when you got that Lugia set in there. Two prizes, like, and that's one potentially. Like, if he can, just oh, he, pl he plays a, three of them. Keep a ruins in play, like he may not even have to deal with it. That's what I'm saying.
Oh, we were actually just informed that uh, he does play a few cards that got some bench snipes. So, I mean, that, the Lugia and the Blastoise are in way worse. Yeah, the, the Mewtwo has Delta Switch. And there's one more. Oh, yeah, the Rayquaza Holy Star. Uh, can do 100 damage to each of your opponent's EX wow. for Fire, Fire, Lightning, Lightning. Which is pretty insane. And that can just be... Uh, we're going to see the Reversal Flip here. Hopefully coming up here for a second. We're just gonna see agility. Agility. Sixty damage and the potential option to prevent damage done is pretty good. Pretty solid. Pretty good. You're not bummed. You're definitely not bummed. With the HP of a lot of these Pokemon, even the thirty wouldn't be the worst. But since you're able to hit with weakness, that's, that ends up being quite a good attack. Yeah, and I mean, if you're Nick Fultz, you're gonna have to like commit to heavy attacker here to knock this Dragonite out. 100 HP. All right, we see him draw the cards with Steven's advice. Yep, just looks like double Jirachi. Not seeing energy here. No energy again. And now at this point, it looks like it could it could honestly swing in Dwayne's favor. I think you're yeah. you're really bummed if you you're not seeing any energy, no cast form. And uh, he doesn't I mean, find the stadium this turn. That Lugia's done after by the time it's his next turn. Yeah. Yeah. You can assume he's gonna get a giant stump right here or something. I have one watching Nick play, and he quick search. I re I realized that. During every quick search, I revealed my card, despite. I like that you did that. Yeah, let's, let's be open about it, was, it. Yeah, I thought it was fine. I was fine with it. It didn't affect my play too much, luckily. Lucy Retriever for the cast form. Yeah. yeah. So. Ooh, so we might have seen... Might have seen a misplay. We might be taking a move back here. Yeah, we see the. We... Oh well, we're we're just uh we're taking the attachment back. Yeah, we're taking some steps back. That Lugia is really running out of steam. Luckily, nothing on the line but pride. She gets serenaded by Brett Michaels. You know. I know. You're <laughs> we see a Ladius Gold Star coming to play. I was actually gonna ask earlier. What do you think they're listening to? In the headphones. Oh, man, Never can uh, tell. Seems like it's probably every rose has its thorn. Uh, Ooh, and we do see the Ladias star come down. 50, but 150 on um, EXs. Pretty good. But um, unfortunately, that's not a uh, popular Pokemon in Dwayne's deck. No. <laughs> Nick Fultz realizing that Latias <laughs> may not be the You're best card for this matchup. Perhaps that EX clause was missed. Yeah, but it's fine. You know, sometimes you only read half of the card. Hey, I've been there. Yeah, done that. You did 200 to my poor Dratini. I know. <laughs> yeah, those uh, whole on cast forms are starting to eat away. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, All Nick right, Fultz, you're not in a good spot right now. Even though he had such a good first two turns, it really looked like Dwayne was stuck. But he was I would, if you had told me turn two, who was gonna win? Uh, Franco was just talking to us before this game started, and he's appreciated the uh, the well, comeback nature of this right. format. Because yeah, you, you definitely. take turns to set up, and things are worth one prize. So. Definitely. Certainly a nice aspect. I mean, pretty much. Dwayne's going to be able to agility here. For 
You'd like to if you're doing you like to see find a Dratini also. Just to keep For sure. just to keep the pressure on. How many cards do you have in your hand? Seven. we're gonna see a scientist here. Are we discarding? Oh uh, the bear. <laughs> nope. Catcher. He feels like he's gonna after this turn, he's gonna be in the lead with that Lugia. So. Definitely. Two. Oh, oh, seven. Oh, we missed, we, we, missed one we did miss because uh, Dragonite is weak to colorless. Yeah, something oh, definitely uh, you won't see in today's game. Dragonite being a dragon and all dragons were... Never could have told you that one. Okay. Yeah, I. I don't think I've ever played when something was weak to colorless, so. Man, I, I do appreciate the opportunity, even though like it's not traditional hey, in the game. Like that's, that's what I'm something. saying. Hundred percent, it's not bad. It's not like there has never been colorless attackers. Yeah, like this is a nightmare. <laughs> agility for knockout. And we're gonna see the agility. And we see Ooh, a head. And we see a head. So that's don't... devastating. Nick Foltz is bombed. And we see Lugia will go down. Three prize turn, big swing yeah, right there. Big the swing. Yeah. Oh, that was close. <laughs> we see an Onyx come down. No, it's a star. Yeah, Nick Foltz is in quite a bind here. Starting to be pretty limited. Very, yeah, his options are very slim. Yeah, especially because you lost two of the cast form that first attack. That was big. That was very big. And I feel like this is something that you'd appreciate, like uh, with your uh, favor for Shrine of Punishment. Like that has really put in work. Yeah, in way. no, it definitely did. And just one of the best like stadium effects, in my opinion. You know, it is. I just like stadiums. I think just anything that can make like one prize little guys more viable. Agreed. Fully agree. All right, getting a couple energy. Putting them back in the deck. Definitely much needed at this point. Nick's going to have to see some cards here. Just trying to... I mean, Dwayne's definitely in the driver's seat now after a very abysmal start. I forgot to dealt the control, too. Twice, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I forgot the cast card three turns in a row. Alright, and then. How many cards do you got? Ten. Ten card hand for Dwayne here. We're probably going to see a scientist. Or copycat. I mean, he transceiver, so he's going to have to get a scientist, but. Yeah. My concern is that I'm a little. Um, a little limited on what would really get him going as an attacker. He has Steelix, but that's still a big concern with and I mean, he's got to evolve it too, which he yeah. can't do this turn. Uh, right, right, this dragon I cannot Unless I don't know. I you, can you rare candy into stage one? First turn? Uh, yes, you can at this point in time. Oh, okay. Just need a little clarification. So you said you had 10, so I draw 5. All right. Getting to a 10 card hand. That's also something that is, seems to happen somewhat regularly in this format yeah, as well. Yeah, I felt like when we played, we had very large hands yeah. the whole time. As long as you can really get going. But unless you were getting admin to like 3 or 2, like you had a large uh, hand no matter turn. what. Transceiver is just super good, like crazy good card. Just being able to get from the discard and from your deck, your choice. Really solid, but Dwayne's sitting there and he knows that Blastoise EX is going to be the last two prizes of the game for sure. Are there like double colorless energies and stuff or no? No, I mean, <laughs> cast form is the closest to kids. 
Or double rainbow or something like that. I think scramble energy existed yet because that's a bomb tower. I think I can afford to give you a prize. Yeah, Nick Fold's definitely just trying to see. He's trying to not give up a prize, which I don't know if he can not give up a prize. I'm gonna help him. What's that? Hold on, Doug. He still has 50. He flipped heads. Okay, so it doesn't look good. Yeah, so I need to mudslide this time. I, I just put him down. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's the point. Well, I remember you saying that this doesn't work. I remember you saying this doesn't damage it. Last time. Just getting some clarification uh, from Jimmy here. Uh, he's trying to see if we could take some form of action to get on the. Uh, offensive, but, but that do, agility has. Yeah, the agility is in play, which uh, definitely uh, pretty debilitating for Nick Fultz's situation. What is this? 30 plus 20. And you can discard from as many as you like. Yes. Yeah. It's like uh, very good. Kind of like our Lucephalon without the Lost Zone. Yeah. yeah. Definitely good. If he could. Dwayne is able to get one dr more Dragonite in play at some point in this game. I really feel like that just would solidify everything. Yeah, I would seal it up. I don't know. I don't. I only think that Dwayne has used like one or two cast farm. And I mean, we see that he has one in his hand. Yeah. Properly do things and actually, when I was looking control. at Nick's le uh, list when uh, we were talking about losing those early cast forms, he has two cast forms and one Magneton. So. Somewhat Another limited Delta in control. what he can do with that double rainbow yeah. type effect. Dwayne, Dwayne plays three total cast form. So, I mean, yeah, if he can get a Dratini set up, I don't, I think he lost oh, two. Yeah, that's and he only plays two. Uh, yeah. Lost one he, and he lost one. Second. Yeah. That is interesting. But if he can just start to get enough just manual attachments in with those... Totally, totally. Adventure. We're going to see Adventure played. Discard. Dragonair. Yep, just building up his board, attach, basic lightning. And we can too, even with that Steelix at a big 150 health, he can just get enough energy cards. If he can get five onto a turn, then he can do a one big crash and burn Yeah. with Metagross along with those Desert Ruins. Agility. See, just another agility. Ooh, big agility flip. Certainly is. Turns out, agility, OP. 30 damage means a lot more at this point in time, and then you uh, add it, pair you can... it with an effect like half 50% chance of not taking damage. Yeah, and I don't know how many, like, catcher ability Nick Foltz plays, but it's not a ton, I think. I think you're pretty limited for your options as well. Seeing the cast form come down. Yeah. We're gonna see a rain dance. Quick gonna see the quick search come out. Looks like he just has the one pow hand extension. Yeah. Yeah, those ruins, uh, you're going to hope, yeah, I was about to say, you're going to need a stump. Like. Uh, if only he could have gotten the stump when the Lugia was in play. Yeah, I thought he was going to that one turn. He had the opportunity to do it, but he, uh, I feel like, was unclear on what the situation was. As I've been for most of the game. Definitely. So yeah, we'll see the stump. He'll probably get rid of uh, that Ladias that just does nothing for him in this matchup. Oh, 
We're gonna see the retreat. And we're gonna see a mudslide. Now we get rid of the cast ball. Yep. Takes the knockout. Not a bad play. Oh, that mudslide is. It doesn't. How, what, what is that? Oh, oh, we and had a special energy. Out, yeah, the metal energy has uh, the 10, 10 damage less. That matters. Discarding that cast form to not take a prize. Yeah, that seems reasonable. Yeah, we'll just knock that. We're learning. Since I saw the prize and everything, just to keep everything on the up and up. Yeah, we're just going to switch the attack to the other one since Nick Foltz did see the prize and we don't want to... Uh, yeah, he's shuffling his hand around already. Farmer. We're going to see Helen Farmer. Holy shit, this thing's got a five retreat cost. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> We just had word that Steelix has a five retreat cost. Pretty, uh, pretty hefty. That is pretty insane. I don't foresee that getting retreated. It would require a little bit too much. I also see double weakness, double resistance. What an interesting card. Hold on, we got a slim deck as well. But we will see that resistance come into play with the. Lightning Pokemon. So definitely. I mean, it's definitely Nick's best... Uh, this is definitely Nick's Never best bet. But we do see the runes come down, which has Never been ending. crippling uh, for Nick Foltz's deck. We're going to see Dratini. Uh, I, th I think, I think it's just... Pick, is it pick a card or trainer card for Metagross? I'm gonna use Delta Charge, so it's uh, attach a metal, I uh, electric, and the discard the Dragonite. Okay. It's any card. That's what I thought. Okay. Yeah, it's any card. Good. Just clearing up that Metagross is pick any card, not just a trainer. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Test for turn two as well. Seeing a very strong turn from Dwayne here. And I'm gonna rare candy it. Ooh. Super Crazy candy. strong turn. Um already delta controls. Um agility. We're still seeing another agility? Yeah, and a yeah. third agility heads in a row. That didn't, yeah, didn't take the, so, no damage. Just no damage. The desert ruins, and then Blastoise as well. Right. What's resistance base? Minus thirty. Thirty. It says right there. Okay. Damage of Blastoise. Still, Nick still Pulse. very good. Blastoise. Blastoise needs the desert ruin. Okay, and we're good. We're back. We're back. Yep. We're back. I mean, if you're Nick here, you're definitely a little bit bummed. I think the the lack of ways to Switch fulfill, those, fulfill those fighting requirements. Um, yeah, it's tough. It's, gonna it, make things it's really for running low now. That uh, second attack is so strong, being able to do 100 wherever you'd like. Yeah. that in mind, the fact that all of Dwayne's Pokemon are one prizers. Yeah, 
It's agility anyway. I mean, I also agility yeah, agility kind of happened. Like the only option for Nick Fultz would be a rock slide, which doesn't necessarily... Oh, he does have the, he does have the Magnus on, which is good. But I don't think that it benefits him at all to do it, to do 90. Last twice as well. Yes, otherwise I'm just gonna lose oh, okay. the, that's for the, that's for the anyway, Megatron. So, okay. Uh, 90 to... Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I'll just do it. So I attach this for two double, two double colorless, okay. and then I reattach it, which is why I took the 10, right. and then I discard this for 90. To which one? This one. Right. And we, yeah, we're just gonna see the mudslide for uh, 90 end to the Metagross. So you gotta assume uh, we'll see Dwayne take control. Uh, can he get a knockout this turn? I believe so. I think he, with if, especially if he has energy and a discard, but I don't even know if he needs it. Um, This could be it, guys. Let's see what Dwayne's got going for him. We're told this could be the end. We've now found out it will not be. <laughs> so I know you guys are excited to see some more. Woo. Oh. Oh. That hurts my heart. <laughs> Jimmy, not necessarily the biggest fan of that move, but we will see where it takes him. You gotta assume we're gonna see a heavy impact here. Jimmy knows the tricks of the trade. He knows all. Well, Dragonite does have a second attack. Definitely. We're gonna double. We're doing some stuff. And we're gonna have. We're gonna see the crowd. Yeah, we're gonna see the. Oh. Dwayne just gets the Beldum. Free retreat. We are going to see a crash and burn. We're going to see a crash and burn. You've got 1,500. I need to do 130. That is correct. He doesn't need to have to do 130 right. damage. Yeah, so 30. So it's a plus 20. Yeah. Yeah. 50, 70, 90, 110. Yeah. Boom. So how much was that? So there's 30, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130. Plus that. It's energy cards, so cast form is just one. So I need one more. Yeah. Well, what knowledge for my co commentator? It's the wording. Instead Boom. of two energy, it's two energy. It's as many energy cards. So well, that does trip us up a little bit on those multi-energy attachments. Dwayne now in the driver's seat. Has to take one prize. We got Desert Ruins in play. We could see it any second here. Yeah, and we are um, even an end to one at this point with his ability to look at the top deck and to put energy back into play from the discard onto his two Dragonites. Yeah, very good. Fine, we're going to see another cast so far here. Yeah, Who knows what Nick Fultz has in mind here to try to mount 
some final push for those last two prizes, but I don't foresee it happening. Yeah, we Dwayne definitely could have done the Rayquaza star last turn to win the game. That's what I hear, but I couldn't tell you how or why. Um, he had the cast form in hand, and then he would have double uh, attached the energy from the Dragonite ability. From that ability, okay. Yeah. Big knockout. You see Nick go down to two prizes, but the future ones may be difficult. Yeah. Oh, I said healing light. Is that enough? I'm gonna healing light. And so Ooh. this stays the same. <laughs> yeah, healing light. And it was okay. a healing light attack that was called. <laughs> turns out. He is healing himself. Wow. Just enough just a little. <laughs> just a little bit. There's no metal energy on that, uh, special metal energy on that Metagross to prevent that from being a knockout, so you may as well. I believe we will see this Latios get knocked out, though, no? Am I wrong? Heavy impact? If we can um, Do the... get the attachment. for Yeah, it's in his hand. No? Am I wrong? Is, it... Is Dragonite to bench Pokemon, perhaps? I'm not sure. I have no idea. Well, he has two of them in play, no? Oh, the crash and burn is what you're speaking of. <laughs> oh, yeah, the impact is... Uh, you heard that. I was like, yeah. <laughs> and we are a PG stream. I'm sorry about that if anyone heard that. I could have done some stuff there. Uh, I think he is realizing uh, his potential turn that he could have had uh, recently. Just reminiscing in past plays, you know. Happens to the best of us. We're going to see an attach from hand. Don't have charge. We're going to see a charge. Don't have charge. Get a second charge. Agility. Big agility heads. Another head. Some would say the, the man is undefeated with any with uh, agility heads. One head last week. And yet we go to Blastoise. Yeah. He did thirty-two. Yeah. Yeah, I was making sure there wasn't a resistance. Um, don't know the Rayquaza well enough. But Dwayne is putting himself in almost a checkmate position for next turn. For sure. 100%. Don't know what Nick is uh, looking for second. here. He's hoping yeah. he finds out as well. I'm thinking he's getting a Blastoise, maybe? Just to have some other option. Who knows? He's going to get Mew? No. Take him out, boys. Yeah, I think he is about out of options. I think he's uh, looking through his deck, realizing there's not much he can do to get him taking like, those last two prizes. Yeah, all you need is two energy. And we do realize it is over. We see wow. Nick scoop it up. Scoops it up. Knows where he was at. Definitely probably knew where he was at a few turns ago, honestly. Yeah. I mean, well, I was gonna, I was gonna guys, thanks for being with us, uh, dealing with our lack thereof knowledge. Hope you learned with us. 2006 yeah, is very we're new, learning, guys. but we're it's learning. a fun old format. Guys, please don't forget to follow the channel. It's free. We're not asking for the sub, just the follow. Click that follow button. Got retro tournaments going on all the time. Yeah, thanks, guys. YouTube's yes, like thank cheating. you.
They don't lose the energy to anyone. So then he has.